Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is about fixing the issue with Roit client. Whenever you are trying to launch Roit client, it just doesn't open or it's not launching at all whenever you are trying to play Valorant or League of Legends. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. Now after running the Roit client, right click on taskbar and choose the option task manager. From here, you need to close the Roit client services. For example, right over here it is Roit client. Right click on it and choose the option end task. Once it is closed, again press the R key to make sure any Roit client services are not running right over here. Again in the system tray icon also, click on this up arrow key to make sure Roit client is not running right over here. Once it is closed from everywhere, click on start menu and type Valorant. You need to click on the option open file location. Now here you will find Roit client, right click on it and choose the option open file location. Now what you need to do is to right click on Roit client services and choose the option run as administrator. Roit client will start right in front of you. If this method doesn't help you fix out, again launch the Roit client. Once you double click to run it, click on this up arrow key and you will find a Roit client over here. Simply go ahead, right click on it and choose the option settings. As soon as you click on the settings, the settings menu will open. Just simply close it and you can see if there is any update option, update the Valorant and launch the Valorant and this will completely fix out the issue of Roid client not opening. If this also fails to work out, in next step, I have a simple tip for you. Go ahead and turn off your system completely. Unplug all the accessories as well as unplug your system from the power supply also. After unplugging all the accessories, Wait for 10 to 15 seconds and then replug all the accessories and then turn on the PC and then again relaunch the client and this will fix out the issue of Roid client not opening. If this also fails to work out, in next step, if you are using more than one monitor, like if you are using two monitor and as soon as you launch the Roid client, then the Roid client is launched in between both the monitors and in turn it is not visible to you. So in order to fix this issue, you need to head over to the settings menu and open the display settings and you need to first of all switch to the main monitor. After switching to the main monitor, you can again switch back to both the monitors and this will launch the Roid client to fix out the issue of Roid client not opening. If this also fails to work out, in next step, click on start menu, type CMD. Run CMD as an administrator. Here you need to type in few commands one by one. First one is net sh int IP reset and hit the enter key. Second command is net sh winshock reset and hit the enter key. And third command is IP config space slash flush DNS and hit the enter key. Now once these commands are completed, as it is saying you must restart your PC. So go ahead, restart your PC and then relaunch the Roid client to fix out the issue of Roid client not working. However, if all the method fails, again Click on start menu, type cmd, run cmd as an administrator. Here you need to find the Roid client services. So type in task list and hit the enter key. This will list all the processes running in your PC. From here you need to find two services. First one is Roid client services and second one is Roid client crash handler. So scroll down and find both the services. You can see here the services. Roid client services and Roid client clash handler. What you need to do is to note down its PID. PID is just next to them. PID for first is 11468 and for second is 13860. You can see here is the PID. Now scroll down and you need to close both the services. So type in task kill space slash f space slash PID space write down the PID of the Roid client services which is double one. 468 and hit the enter key. Now again type in task kill space slash f space slash pid and the pid of Roid client clash handler which is 13868 and hit the enter key. Once both the processes are completed, go ahead open C drive, Roid client, Roid games, Roid client and here you will find Roid client services. Go ahead right click on it and choose the option run as administrator and this will launch the Roid client which in turns 
help you fix out the issue of roet client not launching while trying to play valorant or league of legends so as of now this is all about it friends if this video was helpful for you i request you to please click on subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel thank you so much friends thank you for watching